Okay, so today we are just looking at a FD480R that's going to radio mine Adrian, which has been working bloody treat, nice radio actually. And um, it's given me a chance to go through a few things that are sitting around as well. I thought while I got on the bench, um, not only can I show Adrian a bit more, you know, what it does and that, but uh, Adrian's talking about just wanting a little amp just to put on there, just to um, give him a little bit more power for doing some contacts. I'm sort of taking some of the dust off this one. It's been sitting out uh, uh, in the collection for a little while. This is a Lunar Electronics uh, 80 to 100 watt, uh, you know, sort of was what they were advertised as. Um, a two meter amplifier, does have a receive preamp as well on there. Um, we'll have a look at that in a second. Uh, we're in FM mode at the moment. Uh, let's turn the transmitter off and let's just get a bit of a rough idea what we've got coming into it. Oh, 10 or 12 watts there, about 12 watts. Now we'll turn our amplifier on. And let's have a look, we'll probably Oh, yeah, close on 80 watts. Pretty happy with that. All right, so um, it's about right, uh, especially for 10 watts drive. Uh, these will take a bit more drive actually, but um, sometimes um, running them at uh, you know 80% versus 100% is not so silly. Now, I think from memory they'll go to about 15 watts drive, uh, but um, let's have a look on sideband. Now, on sideband, you'll flick your delay in as well, just so that you're not. Um, uh, sort of c c c cutting out <laughs> like so and let's just have a look here hello one two hello 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 one two hello 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 one two i'm not actually on sideband at the moment i won't bother going to sideband i mean i could sit there and manipulate this and one two one two uh, <laughs> and then i've then i've got to set my generator up don't i hang on i'll have a look at that Okay, they're a little bit finicky. I, I do like the Motorola for sideband resolution better, but one, two, three, four, five, one, two, one, two, one, two, three, four, five, one, two, one, two, one, two. A lot of drive there. Um, now, let's um, certainly working fine there. I'm pretty happy with that. Uh, just for sideband operation, don't forget, uh, you've got to go to sideband on the uh, 1200s and you need to take your generator lock off lock and then you'll resolve your sidebands from left to right, basically. When you go back to FM, just flick it back over, back to FM. All right, now, next thing we're gonna do, we're just gonna generate a signal about, as you can see, about 20 microvolts. And what we wanna prove here is one that we can see a signal, which is great, but we wanna improve the signal. Now, I've had a lot of comments about these, um, and I've made them about um, whether or not anybody really likes two meter preamps uh, due to the fact that most people tend to be, when they're serious, using masthead preamps, totally agree. Do they bring the noise up as much as the signal? Sometimes they do, absolutely. But a lot of them don't work. To be fair, a lot of them have FETs that have gone in them and you can't even get the FETs half the time. Um, but anyway, let's see. Okay, so we've got about 20 dB increase there, 15, 20 dB roughly. I'm guessing a fair bit there. Um, but yeah, at least 10 dB. So um, that's that's working. How, how well it works, you'd really have to do some tests into the noise and you know, I suppose the way to do that would be to turn the volume down on this a bit. Um, make sure we've got very little. So I'm, I'm, I'm down to 0.5 of a microvolt there. So it's hearing 0.5 of a microvolt. Now, the big, the big challenge is to say, well, does it bring that up and not bring the noise up with it? Not bad, actually. Fair bit of noise around the signal there at 0.5. Let's take it down to a little bit further. Oh, see, I, I don't know whether we'll be able to resolve that once we, let's have a look. So we're down about uh, minus 18, 118, sorry, uh, dBm. So heading down towards, towards uh, 0.2. Yep, no, no, it's working. It's, it's definitely working. I'll give it that. You can hear it does bring the noise up with it a bit, but I think it brings more signal than noise. So maybe a thumbs up for the Lunar Electronics Receive Preamp. It certainly works. All right. Now let's go the opposite direction. Yeah, loads. Okay, so there's a lot of lot of gain in that preamp. Um, uh, actually, quite a bit. All right, let's just turn that off. Well, quite seriously, uh, this little uh, amplifier, nice way to get yourself up to uh, 80, 100 watts uh, on a, um, a little 10 watt radio. And you effectively, with a beam out there, could be a force to be reckoned with. You certainly could do some repeater chasing from, you know, all around Australia when tropo and bits and pieces start to happen. And, and you certainly could be um, 
uh, having a bit of fun on 144.1 sideband uh, with, you know, that and a, maybe a beam just being able to direct around the place a bit. But, uh, yeah, no, not bad. All right, that's just a quick test. Adrian, um, I'll send you this video just so that you can have a look. Um, uh, to be fair, I'm using a customer's radio. This is Adrian's radio. Uh, it's got to go out to him today. But um, Adrian just asked me about amps, and I thought, oh, look, we'll have a bit of a quick look and um, just see what we might be able to find. Uh, all right, 73 is to you. Please subscribe. Hit the notify button and uh, hit the like button, all that stuff. Um, we're trying to get moving a bit at the moment. Uh, next job I've got to look at is a 2100Z amp, which um, is way overdue. Um, we're just doing little bits as I can. I'm, I'm getting a couple of hours a day tops at the moment, and unfortunately health is the issue. But uh, that being said, you know I'm trying to sort of still get in and get, get a hand in and do a couple of things. We'll try and release a couple more videos, of course. And um, there's a lot of stuff I'd like to show you. It's just we just get, they're not getting to it at the moment. Um, due to uh, not enough hours in the day that are uh, me moving about. Anyway, um, apart from maybe take a bit more dust off this one, uh, that's, that's a nice little working device. Lunar Electronics, look at that, all the way from WeWar. Um, that's uh, come out of um, WeWar Electronics up uh, the, the north, uh, northern New South Wales. Um, um, great company they were, really were. Uh, uh, unfortunately, the owner's deceased now, but um, certainly uh, did a lot of repeater work up there and. Uh, northern New South Wales and Queensland, etc. So a lot of the, you guys would know him. Okay, all the best. Cheers.